In this video, another great overlay to show notification styled alerts for follows, cheers, subs, resubs, gift subs, gift bombs, raids, hosts, height trains, and tips. Hello and welcome to Streamer Bot Bytes, where I cover how to set up and to make the most of the awesome Streamer Bot. There is one video per topic to make it easy as possible to follow and find. When relevant, sample import code will be provided to make it even easier for you to get started and to add functionality to your stream. So let's get started with the topic for this video. Setting this up in Streamer Bot is incredibly easy. Just select the Service Clients tab, the WebSocket server, auto start and start server. The next thing to do is to build up the URL for the browser source. This is configuring the alerts system to customize it to both your channel and to the options you want. Looking at the description, you'll find this is the main URL you want to start with, where you change the your name here to be your Twitch account. This means that the alert system will know which account to pull the graphic from to display on the notifications. If you want to look at customizing other things like which port or which server. Uh, so this is if you are running StreamerBot on a different machine or on a non-standard port. This section here is for you. Very few people will need to use this. So we won't cover that in detail. If you want to only include certain events or exclude events, you can specify on the URL any of these options here. So for example, if you wanted to exclude for some reason hosts, just put the and plus hand host on the end. And so we build up this URL as we go through. So if you want to add multiple of those, for example, you don't want to also have a follows on there. You just put another ampersand follow. So we just keep adding onto the URL until we're done. We can also do things like fonts. So we can specify the font family using font fam equals the font name. We can do the font color, font cull equals blue, or if it's an RGB value, font code equals C, 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 C. So it's red, green, blue values going between zero and F in the standard HTML colors, which you can find in there. You can also set a background as well with BG color, also BG col and BG code. But for the example, let's just look at the basic URL at the top with this one here. So we're going to put that into the clipboard and let's go over to OBS and put it in there. So add in the browser source, locate the scene you want to put this in, recommending a scene which is then included in all the other scenes. So you generally want that to be showing these alerts in every scene. Alternatively, you can add a browser source in each one or add it once and then copy it across. So in that browser source, We'll call it SB Alerts. Doesn't matter on the name. URL will paste in that. Of course, I'll put my own broadcast name in there. I'll set the full width and height. There's no sound or anything from this. There's not, nothing like that we need to configure. And there we are. We're all set and ready to test. So in the current version of StreamerBot, that's under Settings and then Events and the relevant tabs to trigger the events to test. In the next version, this may well change. Um, I believe it's currently underneath a Twitch tab, but we can click on the test and we can see it's doing the notification with my display image, be it follows, be it subs, gift subs, even gift bombs. 
raids, hosts, they're all going to see, as you can see, that they're notifying the events. And there you go, it really is as simple. Please like and subscribe to be notified of more videos like this. If there's a topic you'd like covered, please do let me know in the comments or on Discord. Check out my Twitch stream to see the bot in action and for other examples. The links to my Twitch, social media and to streamer bots can be found at vrflad.com. Additional links to others that provide streamer bot content can be also found in the description. Finally, thank you Nate for making a great bot and please consider supporting his Patreon which is linked from streamer.bot.